Happy Friday. We're so happy that you're here. We just had a little chaos because Evie wants the breakfast croissant. Um, we did a vlog, so if you liked the video, we hope you come back tomorrow. It's Friday of Jamesy's birthday long weekend. He's still kind of upset about the croissant ordeal. Um, so yeah, happy Friday. <laughs> his piano we got a fall ambiance YouTube video on you tell her say no no Evie it's okay baby <laughs> I think he's saying baby but it's 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 questionable but he's gotten no no down when it comes to this pup when I went grocery shopping at Trader Joe's, I got myself a Friday little soda pop, and it's lemon and elderflower, so I'm gonna try it right now. It's good. It's similar to like um, San Pellegrino, which I love. It's still pretty sugary, um, but a whole lot less of like fake ingredients. Like, it's pretty simple, so. I dig it. Ooh. Say no, no. Yeah. Oh, just eat your croissant in peace. Um, look at this gorgeous day. It's like 57. A very subtle breeze. Ah, a cloud in the sky and the sun beaming. I got one for my flu, one for my COVID booster. We are just waiting for the shots now. Where society is. Where I am and have been. It's getting closer. It's getting closer. You guys are cute. I'm back from my from my shots and Sarah opened up the ghost pepper potato chips. They're really good. Are they spicy? Mm -hmm. But not bad. Do you guys remember this video? We'll put it in the link below. It's one of my favorite videos we've ever made in the whole time because 2018 parks were a good time for the Brookharts. We're hoping that, you know, 2022 and on and on have a similar vibe to 2018. Oh, Teddy's looking in the world. Coming to James's favorite store. Ooh, look at all the pumpkins they have for Monday. We're gonna have to pick one up. Um, we need jackfruit for our jackfruit burnt ends and maybe some liquid smoke. I don't think we have any at home. Ooh. There's some good looking pumpkins. Plenty for carving, Teddy. Change of plan, because they didn't have canned jackfruit or fresh jackfruit. Um, we're gonna make some like quinoa delicious hummus bowls instead. I also got a holiday treat. And some uh, store-made guac and tortilla chip deals. And he's like, he was asleep, and then he was awake, and then he was asleep, and now he's awake looking at the world. Hi, Teddy. You see yourself? Teddy. Teddy. Teddy is your name. ba bong ba bong ba bong All right. <laughs> Teddy. <laughs> What's this leg doing? <laughs> You're going to help me cook? We got water heating up to boil for the tricolored couscous. We're going to chop up some veggies. And you're the happiest kid in town, huh? Huh? All right, we got the fixing of the bowls getting ready. We got couscous. Ooh. It's gonna be mwah. All right, here we've got some spinach with some balsamic vinaigrette, or balsamic vinegar, salt and pepper. And then right here, we've got the cucumbers, the tomatoes, the pepperoncinis chopped up, and the tri-colored couscous. Right here, we've got a really cute baby. Teddy, I see you over here. You better behave. You better be a good kid. Oh. So we're gonna toss this up 
And then there's one ball for each bowl. It's gonna be great. Got James's over here going. We're then we're gonna spritz some. Uh, we're gonna spritz some lemon on it, and then I'm gonna try to get some um, some scrapings for the very top for some garnish. Here's the finished product. I was able to get some lemon zest on there. There's so the the also the toppers right there are the garlic spread and hummus as well. And then we've got a box of garlic naan chips that we can bring out as well. Just kind of mix it all up and devour it. I'm happy to have the vlog up. It actually was pretty simple. Um, I think I'm gonna switch my like, when I edit the vlog up. I feel like we're doing a lot of reevaluating this weekend of just like our everyday ins and outs for what's working and what's not. James just woke up from his snooze. Um, and I think I'm gonna edit in the morning. I don't know, we'll see how it works out. Any encouragement? Oh no, hold on. James, James is all right. Teddy's all right. We just seem a little weird. All right, um, we're gonna eat dinner. Peter's been cooking so I can get the vlog up. I also need to edit James's two year video tonight. That is the plan. I think in yesterday's vlog, Peter mentioned how like tonight isn't gonna be as like fun of a day of a weekend. Um, fun in its own way, but the rest of our weekend and Peter's long weekend, we're busy bees. So tonight, we're gonna set ourselves off on a good foot. Guess what? While I was posting the video, yeah. I do like at the end of every vlog, it's what happened a year ago today. In the vlog I posted a year ago today, you got your first COVID booster. Hey -o. <laughs> so, and then in today, today we now we're both boosted again. Um, that was a crazy happenstance. All right, so we added some of the non chips. This is some of the fruit and veggies I chopped up for Jamesy. He is here. He's got non chips, garlic dip, hummus, the dip tomatoes. Is the reason for my life. But like I think we said yesterday, he eats in sections, so he'll probably eat all the strawberries and blackberries, and then probably I'm going to bet tomatoes next, chips, and then ended up with the couscous. This was just one of those moments where we really truly missed out on not having a vloggy out because James got a birthday present from Karen and Kayla. Thank you so much, because he literally, like, saw it, took it, took it, ran hugged it, rang it, ran it to the table, and was just looking at it with such admiration. Say thank you. It's keepy uppy. Yeah. Big step. <laughs> <laughs> Big stuff. It's really weird about those stuff. Really. <laughs> oh gosh. We need to get fresh air. We have things we need to get done tonight at home, but it is Friday. Yeah, and we're going down Halstead because it's Friday night of Halloween weekend, and we're gonna, oh, we're gonna, yeah, see some costumes, just feel the energy. So we figured out like our neighborhood's Halloween is Sunday. Last year was on a Sunday, we just assumed that it was like, that was what Halloween was. So we don't really know what's going on actual Halloween here. Yeah. But it's been fun seeing like the signs and stuff and getting ready for it. So Halston is trick or treating tomorrow. That's right. And then Broadway has trick or treating Sunday. Wait. But we're gonna be going to our friend's house tomorrow morning and then downtown for a parade tomorrow night. Like, it's October 4th. Uh, I saw somebody the other day said something online. I was like, oh my gosh, since when did Halloween, or since when did, when did October get four hours long? And I was like, truly, like it was all of a sudden just gone and over with. Yeah, that makes crazy. Yes. Hello. Are you ready? Are you ready for night nights? Teddy is down for the night. Peter's putting Jamesy down now. Um, and I was just reminded from my time hop that it's it was two years ago was my due date with Jamesy, and two years ago when we went in to start the induction process. And obviously he wasn't born until November 1st. Um, if you have never heard our birth story with James, I will link it up here. Um, we actually aren't having 
like a party or any get togethers for James's birthday this year. Just the way that this year has kind of transpired, it just worked out better that we're going to kind of just have our small little celebration um, on his actual birthday. And then obviously we are going to Disney mid month and that is kind of like a part like a part of we're going to be celebrating his birthday um but tomorrow we are headed to my friend lauren's house um her her husband mikey and lucy we're all gonna hang out and they're actually giving jamesy his birthday presents tomorrow so the little surprise package from karen and kayla and then tomorrow um we are actually like we're gonna we're gonna have a cake on halloween for like, when we go to my sister's house um for james but it's just kind of like is really sinking in that we're celebrating our two-year-old it's it's wild it's humbling it's it's something else um so i am going to work on his two-year video um and hopefully like we've actually been pretty productive tonight but hopefully we'll all be going to bed very soon the kids have been asleep and sarah's been working very diligently and Jamesy's, Jamesy's year number two montage, one second a day. I'll give you a little sneaky. <laughs> I promise I'm gonna shave tomorrow. <laughs> and I promise I'm gonna pull it on tomorrow. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.